The overall goal of this experimental protocol is to present an improved individualized method to measure thermal temporal summation and conditioned pain modulation. This method may advance the field of pain medicine because reliably measured temporal summation and conditioned pain modulation will facilitate the diagnosis and prognosis of many clinical pain syndromes. This technique increases the success rate in capturing temporal summation and conditioned pain modulation by individualizing the thermal stimuli using these tests, thereby minimizing floor and ceiling effects. Though this method measures only temporal summation and conditioned pain modulation, it may be combined with other QST modalities to fully characterize the sensory profile of a patient. Visual demonstration of this method is important because both temporal summation and conditioned pain modulation require extensive training and complex sensory stimuli, which are best demonstrated on video. Begin by turning on the thermode in the computer. Program the sequence of single heat pulses for training trial 1 with the following parameters. Heat pulse duration equals 0.5 seconds. Interstimulus interval equals 10 seconds. Ramp rate equals 40 degrees Celsius per second. Then, sequentially increase the baseline and peak temperature of each pulse according to the temperature settings table. Present the computerized visual analog scale, COVAS, to the subject and define the anchor points such that 0 means no pain and 10 means the worst pain imaginable. Allow the subject to practice moving the lever left and right until comfortable. For the first training trial, instruct the subject